That means there's too much pressure. The nerves. How do you handle the nerves? And off we go in game seven. A fastball is upstairs, 1-0 on. Oh. In game three. Yeah. One down on this. Gets ready to face off with Corey Seager. One of the things for tonight, I, I, I need to put pressure on the home team. Oh, and Corey Seager always is. On this 1-0 from Javier. Seager hit the first. Just get on top of the fastball. They have patient of the strike zone. He crushes it. He has been big way in the first inning of game seven. Now here's Evan Carter. John, you talk about three balls, one strike. I just can't tell you when. Right away, you're seeing a tight up fastball up, and he did it in the best way you can. He's given up 22 stolen bases in 25 try. I mean, have you ever seen a guy walk? There goes Carter, swing and a miss. There's a miss. Stolen from Javier Garcia fouls it back. He had one to hit there. He cannot afford huge swing after huge swing. And that fastball is his gift. Right now, he's not Way off. Garcia gets up. Goes off the wall. Car nothing, Texas in the first. He got on top of it. He thought it was gone. He's standing there now. He wasn't going to get to second if he did when, that. <laughs> but he yeah. did that. John, what was it? Longer. There goes Garcia. They're picking on Javier. He's stuck. Second base now. But that's what you have to do. And these threes. Two and two on Garver. When you, you finished that up and he said, two, two. Garver. First now comes on. And that ball's going to fall. It's not in time. It's three to nine. This couldn't be a worse start for Houston. One of the decisions for Dusty Baker was who to play in center field. He went Chaz McCormick. Uh, John, you talk about a lot of times the stars in the lineup can do anything. And then the two home runs the off year. Now the Rangers offense, the top offense. Oh, two to high. Chase Hill. Garbert of third starts coming into this game in his career. Chris, it's Maton on the first low. And the first pitch hey. curveball at the knees. Literally one inning at a time, of course, and he's got to hope his off. Got first and third for low. Chops it foul, and he's quickly ahead 0 2 what these teams can do and how quickly they can do it. Maton's 1-2. His swung on a miss. He strikes out low. Big second out. Expect the unexpected in this series. This is... You said last night you were going Woo! to uh, come on because you've done this before. You don't know how and who's going to come out. Maton to Young. Well, Young started that five. He's had some iconic swings that you all... Got a chase. Strikes one and two. And that's been his... First 2-2. Uh, two, two. Got him at the high fastball. Those who have a great offense and just have not been able to hit at home. That's how it was that he was probably done for the year. But he proved everybody wrong. He can't John, the biggest question is how is he going to pitch? Pitching. Now two to the left. And it bangs off the wall. Ironically hit the bottom of the first. <laughs> Takes the place of a rehab start. This is it essentially good okay. for Max the other day? There's a good cone. His counterpart's no longer in the game. So he wants to. Here's his 2 1 to Alex Breckman. It's tap foul. Already much a with a slider or curveball without having proper mechanics. On this 2 2 from Scherzer. Scherzer. Soft hands. Wow. And the emotion of pitching in a game seven. It starts actually getting more nervous. He's had five consecutive multi hit games. Outside. So you've got a three run lead. How do you mess with him? Go put him on first right now. That's exactly what they're going to do. Whereas, and in these situations, if he cashes in, you tip your hat. I mean, he often has traffic when he does. More oh, RBIs man. than any player in the American. The Braves' first year in Houston. Takes a fastball down Woo! the shoot. This is eerily similar home run that caught at the wall. Oh, I've got a lead. Young that gets the S strong single from Jose Abreu. Here we go. Offense is ready to go in game seven. Ball down the line. You've talked about the early starts the road teams have had. There have been. Simeon should be two. Four, six, three, double play. Brown who comes home to Leone Tavares. Brown pitched three scoreless innings. Shows it right there. One ball, one strike. Out of Detroit, fires a 1 1 pitch. It dips low on Tavares. Which they desperately need tonight. Ball three. 
kicks and fires the 3-1 pitch, and Tavini is there on the right side of the bat. Now that I'll tell you what, the D-backs have forced a lot of people to take a look at. With both series Ooh. beginning 2-0. As Marcus Simeon taking and started this game with the ground out to short. He's got it spotted. Crowd number two did the job, and that's what Dusty Baker's hoping to do, that he can get at least two or three innings. Scoring with an upper deck home run in the first oh, inning. So huge for Texas. You made an interesting point, John. That, yeah, absolutely. And then they had four or five. or six. A lot of it wasn't hitting. And so I just felt early on he came out trying to the Rangers. Well, he'd be the first to tell you he's not a guy. That Goes, bounces to the wall. At top of the zone, great sign for him. Velocity sometimes beating these hitters, but tonight. Walked and scored Ball his one. first time. I'm telling you right now, what, what's that thing <laughs> you wear on your wrist? The Fitbit or whatever. He will not slow down at all. On this 2-0 pitch. That's a strike. It's funny, we saw him after the game last night. At the knees, 2-2. Brown delivers, Carter, Bregman, and a score of second inning. In his swing before time runs out, and routine for Evan Carter. And that one championship ring that he earned right here in Houston. It was two days That's after inside. he couldn't even turn his head. And Scherzer his ring. Two balls, one strike on Chaz McCormick. That Max is dealing with is obviously... And so the one thing that you know, you called a very tight zone, it has been called very tight. Advantage. Here it comes. McCormick ball takes four. ball four. Joe. His wife Erica said he couldn't turn his head, couldn't dress himself, couldn't. She believed it. She said, I know it sounds silly, but I believe in the baseball. Said that when he hurt his shoulder this time, he took one day. It's a little more than a month since injuring his shoulder. Little. His 1-1 one -one to Pena, runner goes on a foul back, and McCormick had a good job. Manager on the other side tonight, Dusty Baker. And he's just the answer if a guy can keep going on. And he's looking at Max, and he says, Max, there's the runner going again. Oh. Throw from high, is high and late. Pena, here comes Scherzer. Got him with a fastball. Tied him up with a lineup that has got to be taken care of. Look, this guy at the plate. Yeah, just kind of a thorn in their side in the series. Yeah, the Scherzer home with it on one. That's inside. Check swing and a ball yeah. inside. Oh, two. He yes, does. Maldonado can't lay off this. Leads off this third against Hunter Brown and takes a strike. Please. He's had it in Cardinals. Makes it to the oh. major leagues, but then the Cardinals. He's been an all-star twice hey. in three years. Two balls and two strikes on him. You can make the argument that have him pitch this one inning instead of two. This tied Nelson Cruz for the most RBIs in one post. He starts the third and drives. He does! Playing the villain. I mean, that... We didn't see any of that. They have the lead right now. He has homered in four consecutive oh, games until he was a teenager because his brother is dead. Ball three. But he painted and lost it in the stands. Full count. Browns pay off. Oh, got strike three. Really, other than an Astros fan, how do you not smile watching Adolis Garcia play? Heim. 0-2. They struggled big time on the, in a tunnel right now. Whatever they... Another 0-2 to Heim is down away, and it's 1-2. and two. Heim tries to lay off a ball in the dirt and blood. He's in the third. Full count on high. Three. Just the improbable. Game seven. He was dead in down the heap of the grass there. Heim is up. Same thing on all four swings on fastballs. And a lot of that had to do with facing Javier a second time. He had nowhere else to go. And time you told us when Javier pitches that we're doing a better job replicating that high fastball. Just time that fastball 
is less magical, more familiarity. Get ready. Here's a two one. Low takes strike two. <laughs> Spits the plate like a house fire. Jose Altuve he doubled off of the wall. First <laughs> pitch that he saw from Altuve. Perf here. Simeon gets a second base. Con Seven getting leadoff hitters off off the bases is huge. Keep that from happening. Well, what you didn't say was the finish to what happened. Strands two. That Good double job. play was huge. And Max Maxwell has the last chance they have to score. That's inside. Some guy staying locked in. It's in on Bregman here. Flips a little pop up. I'm better than you. It, it just it, it in. Two two. And that blows off the top. Now it back up. So much so that sure as a can. The middle third is what Bregman owns. A fan of the one we saw last yeah, night. Last night. Man. He needs a glove. Woo! Alvarez takes a strike on a curve. Mm. So it's live going out and getting fires another 0 2. Inch and it's hooked foul. Foul straight back. Fastball again. His rest. Another 0 2. They get that cutter in on him. Seven pitch. The Reds not gonna get him. Oh, not gonna get him. He this is just why this guy's so good and so strong, and why this part actually over jumps it. Right? That's a tough word. With less than two outs. There's a one. Abreu swings and misses. One of the best curves he's throwing. Shooting his pitches because when you're in the windup, the oh two. The job done. Young tosses across for a big sex game, taking Scherzer out with two gone in the third inning. Downstairs, last pitched on Friday. Brantley scolds one, but right at Seeger. Championship. Already the fourth pitcher of this game for the Astros. 28 year old rookie pitcher. Falls behind 2 0. Doesn't have it that, that night, right? So you can mix it. Eesh. See what he does on 3 1. It is another fastball. Now the counter. Here's a payoff. Fastball. He challenged them. And it, that, that's got to come. New platform embodying the sports philanthropic contributions and mental wellness time. Takes upstairs ball for ball. We've also okay. seen him swing away to great effect. Home at a Whoa. Took hey. it. On this 2 1. Got another changes right over the heart. I mean, they just know it's not enough. Four runs is not enough. Francis 2-2. Two -two. Got him with a big curve. Just barely held on in that game. All one. And so they know these Astros are in uh, the depth of their bullpen. Yeah. Now they felt pretty good when they've had just the top few during the decision of this game. He's either going to come in and be the dominant. Green light of Simeon Watson. He'll instead take ball four. They're first and second for huge decision and I'm sure tell have his iPad looking through all his swings He's finding this see what France goes with it is a good curve that's a great pitch and that's first and second one away Seeger it squirts free and everybody sits it almost back towards the pitcher's mound a little bit Boris <laughs> Seeger by the way came into this game five for 20 that is fair the kid cutter World Series, would this be the hit that breaks a mission? Good stop by Maldonado. Otherwise, you would load the bases up and play. But the infield in, Garcia takes high, and it's 2 0. I wonder at what point they just. His 2 0 is. By the base hit. Seeger's just going without a throw. It's him to try and strike him out, but you're talking a total different hitter. Fastball, now the count is full. Here's a payoff. Fastball, and why? Yeah, I. We've also seen him swing away at a great effect. Home against Justin Verlander in game one. On this 2 1. Got another change. He's right over the heart of the dump it back. Francis 2 2. Got him with a big curve. And as long as they can. Now they felt pretty good when they've had just the top few guys going tonight. He's going all one way or another in the decision of this game. He's either going to come in and be the dominant version. And, and take green light of Sidney and Watson. He'll instead take ball four. They're first and second for Seeger. 
See what France goes with. It is a good curve. That's a great pitch. And that sets up the at bat for an aggressive hitter now. And now you first and second one away. Seeger pulls one right side that's knocked down by a Abreu. It squirts four. Carter pulls one down the line. That is fair. The kid cut. His 2 0 is over the plate and grounded to the left side of base hit. Seeger's in. Here comes Carter. Two out for Heim. That is a fair ball. I'm sick of losing at home. But it has continued tonight. More loud contact. Jonah Heim. Bang. Two run double. Four pitch walk for Neris to load the bases. They've batted around. Make his job on the mound easier. Young grounds one left side. Payne is there. Long throw. Good. Just two pitches to get out of that inning. It's in on Kyle Tucker, who flied out in the first pitch that he, where he wants to be. It seems hey. like when you go in a funk, you're and he's hitting 139. He's knocked in just one. He's down trailing at a curve in the dirt here. Chaz McCormick walked his first time out in front of the first pitch. Astros have scored eight runs. Montgomery comes back home, and McCormick shoots a base hit the other way. He's been on both times. Would love to get something here for Pena, who was a rookie last year. Pena's got a base hit. And Bruce Bochy's got already be. For Garcia. Two out. Two on, two out. The 1 0. El Tuve takes a strike. Woo! It was a fast ball, but perfectly. El Tuve sends one in the air to right, but got it off the end of the bat. And Garcia's going to make the grab.